Hi guys and kaboom! Yes, and welcome to the channel to my made simple attack strategy series for Town Hall 12. And who's that on the army camp? Yes, of course, it's Wendy, the super witch, and her friends. And today we've got an absolutely amazing attack strategy for you. We're going to check out the army composition now, and then in just a moment, watch a couple of amazing replays, guys, where I'll show you how to use it against Town Hall 13 bases and Town Hall 12. So, first of all, let's meet the troops. Your army is going to consist of... One minion, of course, that's Mike the minion. If he's on the battlefield, you're in with a really good chance of getting three stars. Then it's going to be golems, three of them, nine witches, and two super witches. Your spells is going to be different. Your spells are going to be different, guys, depending on the town hall you're attacking. For town hall 13, we're going to go for six lightning spells, one earthquake, three freeze, and one poison. And when you take on town hall 12 bases, you can have eight lightning spells, two earthquake, and either one freeze or one poison. It just means that Town Hall 12, because you've got those eight lightning spells, you can take out two Inferno Towers. But both of the replays are different, guys. One of them is against the Town Hall 13 and one against the Town Hall 12. So I'll show you how to use both variations. Your Clan Castle troops will be two Yetis and a wizard by the name of William. Your Clan Castle spell will be a Rage spell to sprinkle on top. And normally you're going to be using the new and amazing Log Launcher or the Wall Wrecker. So we're going to jump into our first replay in just a moment, guys. Before we do, just a quick reminder on this channel, we've got something called a Creator Code. That's where you can help support this channel in-game. It's easy. Just go to settings, scroll down, more settings, scroll down, support a creator. And if you use code Moose before making any purchases in-game, it just helps support the channel. So through the clouds we go. And guys, we're going to be taking on a Town Hall 13 base. And I've accidentally forgot to bring a poison spell. I normally bring free freeze and one poison. So guys, don't make this mistake because it could cost us the three stars. Now against Town Hall 13 bases, you're going to have six lightning and one earthquake spell. That's because you want to take out a scatter shot, guys, because they're horrible and the witches really don't like them. So we've taken out one scatter shot there. Obviously try and take out any surrounding structures as well. And then it's funnel time, guys. Golem on the left, golem on the right with a couple of witches. And then just take your time. Don't rush the attack. How often do you run out of the allotted time on attack? You don't, guys. Hardly at all, anyway. So don't worry. Take your time. Make the funnel. And then put in the rest of the troops in the center. What I like to do is put the king down with a golem. Then the log launcher. So the defenses are distracted. And then use that Grand Warden ability night and early. Look at those logs flying out. Damaging the town hall now. Or in a second. And this is looking okay. This is looking okay. Use those free spells to freeze any nasty defenses, giving your troops any issues. And of course, you've got that. Um, you've got the rage spell as well, just to help the troops get towards that town hall and take it out. Put the rage spell there. Will anybody go into it? Yes. Thankfully, they no. Everybody's avoiding the rage spell. Although no, they're not now. This is okay. So we're looking okay. We need to take out that town hall quickly. Yes. Take out that remaining scatter shot. And the clan castle troops are out. And I reach for my poison spell, and I think, oh. I haven't got one. And the worst troops possible when you haven't got a poison spell are probably witches or super minions. And those super minions are doing so much damage. And guys, I really think we're on course for three stars here. But these super minions are really causing us some issues. They're doing so much damage. They're still there, guys. Just taking out my heroes, uh, being annoying. And uh, at this point, I was thinking I really wish... I had a poison spell. So I would say with the strategy, use a poison spell. But we've still got a chance of getting three stars, haven't we? We've got a, we've got Barry, the big boy skeleton on the left-hand side. We've just lost the queen. Can these troops that we've got left three-star the base? It's going to be close. A super witch, Wendy the super witch, and two witches. That's what we've got left. But you never know. We need to take out that uh, wizard tower really quickly. And if you think this replay is close, you should see the next replay against the Town Hall 12 base, guys. It's even closer. Uh, this is going to, uh, yeah, go on, Barry. You can help us get this. Go on, Barry. It's going to be close, guys. I think we can three-star this base. Barry, the big boy skeleton, has got loads of health left, unless it's going to be a time fail. Ten, nine, eight, seven. It's going to be close. Come on, guys. Mike, the minion's there as well. Yeah, no. We ran out of time. A time fail against the Town Hall 13. 99%. That hurt, guys. But it just shows how powerful this attack strategy is. And here we go. Here's the second replay against the Town Hall 12. So we've got eight lightning spells and one... No, eight lightning spells and two earthquake spells this time to take out both inferno towers four lightning and one earthquake on each so there we go there's one gone and now we turn our attention to the other inferno tower and guys i mess up i've messed up we should be yes it's still there we should be able to take out both inferno towers four lightning and one earthquake will take out both inferno towers or two of them sorry there's three aren't there it will take two so guys 
We've left one Inferno Tower remaining. It doesn't matter though, that Inferno Tower is not going to cause us any issues. Guys, it absolutely is. It nearly ruins this attack. That Inferno Tower comes back to haunt us big time. So, again, Golem left, Golem right. Rest of the troops in the middle. Use the Grand Warden ability and that Rage spell. Out come the Clan Castle troops. And again, it's Super Minions, guys. And again, I haven't brought a Poison spell. I've brought a Free spell instead. I find the Free spell really works well. And because you've got those Witches, normally they can deal with the Clan Castle troops. But it just happens sometimes you do wish you brought a Poison spell. And when you bring the Poison spell, you wish you brought a Free spell. So anyway, we're going to take out the Town Hall. This is looking okay. And there he is. That Inferno Tower that we should have taken out earlier is Infernoing everything. And guys, look, it's, oh no, it's laughing at us. And we've just lost a Yeti there, just flung out the arena. The Queen's doing a great job. We've got a Super Witch over on the right-hand side. So we're looking okay. You, you know, this would have been much easier if, it, if we'd taken out that uh, multi-Inferno. So I'm showing you, you know, with my attack shashis, I'm honest with you guys. I'm showing you how to do it and how not to do it at the same time. So just make sure you take your time with those lightning spells and earthquakes. So just to recap, against Town Hall 13 bases, you have six lightning spells, one earthquake for taking out a scatter shot. And against a Town Hall 12 base, you'll have eight lightning and two earthquake spells, four lightning and one earthquake on each of the Inferno Towers you want to take out. So again, that Inferno Tower is really messing with our chances of getting three stars. Can we do it? It's Inferno in the Grand Warden. The Grand Warden says enough is enough. Goodbye. So... What have we got left? We've got the Eagle Artillery still dealing loads of damage and a Wizard Tower there just waiting. The Wizard, the wizard Tower isn't even looking towards us, just pretending he hasn't seen us. And any second here, turn around. We've still got Barry, the big boy skeleton. Can he save the day here? The Queen's doing a great job, but she will. You'll see in a moment the Queen turns around and says, I've had enough. I'm going home. Uh, so look, any second. So we really need your help, Queen. And she says, bye, I'm off. And we don't see her again, guys. That's it. Uh, so, well, she's going to, the Eagle Artillery, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo, and not what you want to see, Barry the big boy stood in a tornado trap. Guys, that happened to me the other day, walking down the street, stood in a tornado trap, and I lost a shoe. So anyway, 1v1, who will win? Is it, it can't be another time fail, can it, guys? No, yes, it can't. Three stars. Thank you. So, guys, whoa. There we go. Really nice attack strategy. I really enjoyed using it. Let me know what you think in the video comments. And remember, there's sort of two different versions for Town Hall 12 and Town Hall 13. So move signing out. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell if you want to see any more awesome videos. Catch you later, guys. Take care.